Looks like it. Demolition crews are already packing up the choppers. Syria? Yeah, it was a bit of a mess. Croft? Constantine didn't expect to find her in there. She managed to We're going to head out with the others? Not yet. Just side. keep your eyes open and do your Speaking rounds. Of Croft, she's still out there. They still want her alive? Not anymore. She's too much. <laughs> she was useful for a time. Hey, give me a hand over here. I think he was trying to kill her. Hold on. Orders are clear. We see her, we shoot to kill. We got incoming! Search the area. Take in position! Target reacquired! We stand now on the very cusp of a new world. The divine source has been located. Croft, while still alive, has been effectively neutralized. But Anna grows weaker by the hour. Her voice, that voice I've known my whole life, is starting to falter. I asked her if she remembers that night, the first night that God carved purpose into my hands, the night that he chose me. She said she did, and then she smiled and said that we would have nights again like that once this ordeal is over. For her, I stay strong. In the old city, we will find the divine source. I will save my sister, and together we will save this world from itself. I won't die in this godforsaken valley. My faith is strong. My will is strong. Even if my mind keeps wandering away. In our youth, Constantine and I in our youth, he, he was a difficult child. Always wondering, always questioning, afraid of what the future might hold. Afraid that he might never find his purpose. The night I cut those marks into his hands, 
The night I whispered into his ear, I made him. I saved him. He believed it to be the work of God, just as I'd hoped. Now I need him to save me. And if in the end he can't, then I'll save myself. Laura! 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 Answer me! Last time I saw you, you were... Damn it, Laura! You better not be dead. After the avalanche, I... I got one little blip, one brief echo. But I'll be damned if it wasn't your voice. I know I heard it. I know you survived. At least the avalanche. I haven't heard a peep since, but I'll keep trying. I know you told me to leave, to get somewhere safe, but... Did you really expect me to leave you here? Come on. You should know me better than that. A rifle shell, but there's something unusual about this one. Latin engraving on the end. Kill them all. God will know his own. Negative. We're moving on to the next phase of the operation. Just get prepped to move. They're here! Got you!
Your loyalty to her is strong. I admire you. I do. But even my patience has limits. Tell me what you know. Now! Please, please, no. Don't listen to him! I was only doing what I believed was right. No! Uh. <laughs> Sweep the cell blocks. Kill everyone. I should have killed him. But he was unarmed, I just couldn't. Shh. You shouldn't have to. I am so sorry for getting you into this mess. <coughs> I thought I could keep up. They're coming. We're surrounded. This time I've got your back. He's dying. We don't have much time. Bar the door. We've got to deal with her. I know that you like to read the archaeological journals now, but I urge you that if you see anything written which is less than pleasant about me, to ignore it. There are those who simply do not understand the work I'm doing here. Perhaps they're even frightened by it, but their fear and stupidity is not my concern, and neither should it be yours. I will explain everything in good time, my darling girl. The people that were frightened, were they Trinity? You never told me. I guess it doesn't matter now anyway. They found their way to me. Now I'm going to have to deal with them.